It's Monday the 21st, and this is what we're having for dinner tonight. Yes, we're having pancakes, and we're having sausage. So, catch you tomorrow. Okay, I'm new at doing the dinners of the week in case y'all wanted to know. This is the sausage that we, it's already fully cooked. It's the Great Value brand. It's okay, but I'll be honest with you, I'd rather have the Rucker sausage that we cook ourselves. And this is the Aunt Jamama Original. This one is really good, but you do have to add the egg, the milk, and the oil, some oil to it. But, and I did not know that when I bought that, but I'm not gonna waste it, so I'm using it up. So just in case y'all wanted to know, and then we'll use the Mistress Butterworth Sugar-Free Syrup. Okay guys, it is Tuesday night, and tonight we're gonna have some ranch taco shredded chicken, uh, tacos. <laughs> Here's the refried beans I've got heating up. We're cooking the Mex some Mexican rice to go with it. It's almost done. And then here's the chicken I cooked in the crock pot all day with some ranch, the ranch powder dressing, taco seasoning, and just chicken broth. And or sour cream, or tortillas, or hot sauce, or cheese. And mm, smells divine. It's Wednesday night, and this is what we're having for supper. We're having leftover uh, chicken, the ranch taco, the ranch chicken tacos. Oh my gosh, they were so good. And be, be back tomorrow. Okay, guys, ah, this is Thursday, and I am going to be making a new recipe for me. And I forgot I was going to film this. I had promised Miss Peggy I would film this as part of the my meal of the my meal of the week video. So far, this is just roast beef. It's this Castlewood roast beef that y'all see me haul in my grocery haul, and I've just placed it all in the bottom of my crock pot. Then I'm going to take this McCormick a uh, Jew <laughs> gravy, however you pronounce that, and we're just going to sprinkle this on top of this this roast beef. And I think I, I don't know if I told y'all not, what I'm try, uh, attempting to make here is a French dip type of sub sandwich. And this idea came, I got this from Sarah, one of my friends I've met off of Facebook. And so I've got that poured and now I just need to add enough water to cover the meat. And we're going to put it on low for two hours and it'll be done. Okay, so now I, it took about six cups of water to cover this, to cover, cover the meat. And I'm just kind of stirring this around. Okay, got that done. Going to get my lid from the Ninja and going to turn this on low for two hours. There we go. And I'll show you when we plate it up. Okay guys, they are ready. It looks delicious. I've got a spoon there. <laughs> they look delicious. And here is what the final take up looks. I toasted my bread first in the oven and then I put uh, the meat and the provolone cheese on it, then put it back in the oven to let the cheese melt. So delicious. So that's what's for supper on Thursday night. Hey guys, it's Friday the 25th, and this is what's for dinner tonight. We're having shake and bake uh, chicken thighs. And y'all remember that macaroni and cheese, the Ar artesian, I guess, uh, Walmart brand uh, macaroni and cheese that I got a couple of weeks ago, and it was like, aged white cheddar and black pepper this is it and the key says it is delicious so that is what we're having for supper tonight we're having that and the chicken yum yum okay guys i was doing so good about filming every night after the last night last night we just had I, we just kind of fended for ourselves, <laughs> and tonight I threw this uh, casserole together. Me and Keith did. We just the leftover chicken from our chicken tacos, and some refried beans, the Mexican rice that we had with some little corn and cheese on top, and that is what we had for supper tonight. And it is I didn't even tell you what day it was. It is Sunday, the twenty seventh. And so I got a picture of my meal every day this week, except last night. 
Hope y'all have enjoyed this week with me sharing you uh, what we had for dinner each night. And let me know if you want me to continue. And see you next week. Mm -hmm.